Greetings everyone and welcome back to our channel. For today's video, we're going to show you how to edit your Wix website after it's already been published. Whether you want to update content, change the design, or make any other modifications, we've got you covered. But before we jump right into it, if you are new here or haven't subscribed yet, now is the perfect time to hit that subscribe button below and do not forget to ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest content. And to our returning viewers and subscribers, welcome back. You all are the heart and soul of our channel and I'm grateful for your continued support. Now, before we edit, okay, before we edit the Wix website after publishing it, all you gotta do first is go to the web browser of your choice. I'm using Google Chrome right now. But basically, Wix.com is compatible to any uh, known web browsers such as Brave, Safari, Edge, and Firefox. So once you are on Wix.com, create your account if you don't have one. Once you've created your account, log in using your credentials. And then when you log into the interface, it should be looking such as this one. Now go to uh, my site. Okay. Go to your sites. If you don't have an actual live site, that's okay. Right? All you're gonna do is hover here on select and edit. Okay. Okay, so now we are here. On the dashboard, right? It'll take some time. Just quick some moment, right? You will be redirected to uh, the uh, Wix website editor, okay? It'll take a little while. Because nowadays, editing a, uh, a website after publishing is a common practice. Why? Because, you know, you might want to make changes or updates your live website. But, you know, regularly updating your website's content is crucial to keeping it relevant and engaging. This could include adding new information, updating product details, or sharing the latest news. And you might want to improve the visual appeal of your website by making design changes. Um, it could, you know, involve updating colors, font, fonts, or layout elements to better align with their brand or current design trends. And also, it's important if you've noticed any errors or typos or broken lines or links to your website, it's essential to correct them. Regularly checking for and fixing each issues improves the user experience and maintains professionalism. And also, to improve your website's um, search engine performances, you might want to optimize your content for relevant keywords like adding meta tags or make other SEO um, enhancements, right? Especially for running promotion sales or events, you'll want to update the website to reflect these changes like including banners, updating product uh, prices or creating new landing pages. Also, if you've developed new features or functionalities that you want to integrate to your website, you will be needing to make these updates post-publishing. If there are new tools, widgets, or integrations available in the Wix platform, you might want to take advantage of that to enhance your website's capabilities. And if your website content needs to change seasonally or during holidays, Updating your website post-publishing is really essential. It, uh, it will keep your site fresh and timely, right? Sometimes it could involve, you know, updating the messaging and restructuring pages or adding any section. So we are here in this live site website. You know, you can go here, design, add ups, you know. You can add media and whatnot and pages and menus. So depends really on what you wanted to change to your recently published Wix website, okay? 
And once again, just remember that Wix, Wix is designed to be user-friendly and the platform makes it relatively easy to edit your website even after it has been published. So regularly viewing and updating your website ensures that it remains an effective tool for your audience and aligns with your evolving business needs. And once again, if you find this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And of course, do not forget to subscribe for more useful tutorials such as this one. If you have any questions or topics you'd like us to cover in the future videos regarding about Wix, please leave a comment below. I read all of them. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.